NASDAQ 100 continues to pressure the upside. Before we start, a quick word from our sponsor. This video is brought to you by XNets, the world's largest retail brokers firm offering ultra-fast executions and no overnight fees. Look for a link in the description below. The NASDAQ 100 has been somewhat quiet during the early hours on Wednesday, which makes a lot of sense considering that we get both CPI and PPI numbers on Thursday and Friday. And that is going to be the big feature of the week as traders will start to look at that through the prism of what the Federal Reserve is going to do next. If that's going to be the main mover of the week, we could see a knee-jerk reaction, perhaps even to the downside, but I think that will end up being a buying opportunity. After all, it's obvious to me that the market is in an uptrend and it's going to stay there. If we break down from here, the 20,000 level is a massive support level and that assumes that we get anywhere near there. I don't even think we do that. We have cleared the 20,500 level a bit and now it's a question of whether or not we can truly break out to the upside. At that juncture, we could go to the 2,000 600 level and then possibly as high as 2750 i do think that anytime the market pulls back you have to look at it as a potential opportunity because quite frankly the nasdaq 100 is driven by just a handful of stocks which are still essentially on fire so with this i remain bullish i recognize that we may get the occasional pullback but i also recognize that as a potential major opportunity if you like the video give me a thumbs up and subscribe